We welcome you on our channel Engineering Study English. Our today's topic is how to install RTD. RTD means Resistance Temperature Detector, as it is clear from its name. By detecting temperature that provides output in resistance. Such type of instrument is known as RTD. Before knowing how to install RTD, we will see where we install it. We install RTD at a place where we need to measure temperature. Means on any tank, in any process line, we install the RTD. Because RTD is measuring the temperature, so RTD is also known as temperature sensor. First, be confirm which RTD you are going to use. Simplex RTD or duplex RTD. If you want to show the temperature only at one place, then use simplex RTD. And if you want to show the temperature at two different locations, then use duplex RTD. The most commonly used RTD is 3 wire RTD, whether you are using simplex or duplex. Simplex RTD has only one port for connections. Means it has three wires for connections. And duplex RTD has two ports for connections. Means you can see six wires for connections. So, if you are using simplex RTD, then you will require a three wire cable. And for duplex RTD, you will require a six wire cable. Now, let's see what are the tools required for RTD installation. Slide wrench, nose plier or plier, wire stripper, a digital multimeter, screwdriver or line tester. Before installing RTD, a thermo well is also installed. Thermo well provides protection to RTD and we can check it anytime by easily removing it from thermo well. First, thermo well is installed. Then, by using slide wrench, RTD is tightened in thermo well. Let's discuss the connections of RTD. For RTD connections, you need to insert the wire. For connections in RTD, you will see three terminals. And if you are using duplex RTD, then you will see six terminals. Suppose there is a three wire simplex RTD, it will have one port and three terminals. And on these terminals, three wires will be connected from inside the RTD. In these wires, two wires will have same colors. And one wire will have different color. Same color wires are kept short circuit. You can check their continuity by using multimeter. And there will be a different color wire. It is also known as common wire or common terminal. Now, connect the wires into RTD coming from control panel. With the help of screwdriver or line tester. After connecting three wires to RTD, these wires are connected to controller or indicator. On controller side or indicator side, you will see a symbol of RTD. The same color wires of RTD are connected to controller or indicator. Here and the remaining wire is connected at the remaining terminal of controller or indicator. Means short circuit wires are connected with short circuit terminals and 
Common wire is connected at common terminal. So, RTD connections are very easy. Till now, you have connected simplex RTD. Similarly, you can connect the duplex RTD. So, that was our video. Thanks for watching the video. If you like, do like and share with your friends. Also, press the bell icon for more updates and further uploads.